I'm Brooke Kirchhofer, and this is your Cardinal Countdown. The women's volleyball team was on the road this week traveling to Abilene Christian and Incarnate Word. Unfortunately, the Lady Cards had problems on the road, losing to both teams 3-1. They are now 12-7 on the season and 2-3 and in South End Conference play. They are perfect this year at McDonald Gym and hope to continue that streak when they kick off at home on Tuesday against Sam Houston State and UCA on Thursday. If you can't be there to support your Cardinals, you can catch the live feed at www.bigredsn.com. The women's soccer team didn't have much luck on the road either. The ladies fell 3-2 at host Southeastern Louisiana. LU put up a good fight by rallying in the second half, scoring two goals. Unfortunately, that wasn't enough. They are now 2-4 and four in Southland play. The ladies return home this weekend for their final two home games of the season at the LU Soccer Complex. They face Abilene Christian on Friday and Incarnate Word on Sunday. Show your support by attending the games. If you can't make it, you can cheer them on through the live feed at www.bigredsn.com. It was a big weekend for not only the Lamar football team, but individual players as well. The team came out with an outstanding win against Abilene Christian at home, 44-28. The team is now 2-1 in conference play, tying them for fourth. Running back Kane Harrington rushed for a single game school and conference record, 347 yards. He also received national honor by being named College Football Performance Awards National Offensive Performance of the Week. Harrington is one of only two players in the conference averaging better than 100 yards rushing per game and currently leads the nation averaging better than 166 yards per game. The Cardinals return to action Saturday when they travel to Natchitoches, Louisiana to take on Northwestern State. Go and support the Big Red. If you can't make it to the game, you can get updates by following Lamar Athletics on Twitter. Show your Cardinal pride by attending the games and following Lamar Athletics on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. I'll be back next week with your Cardinal Countdown Update.